that low lake level pumping station was just completed in 2020, right? And this was the first time we had to flip the switch and activate it. Yeah, the, the elevation in Lake Mead got down to the point where uh, we were able actually to operate it really for the first time without the, uh, the flow dissipators um, and prove out that the pumps are meeting their design criteria. So um, yeah, it's in, it's in operation right now and, and uh, um, no time too soon. And, and we actually told ourselves at the time, right, we're going to build $650 million in infrastructure that we hope we never turn on. And then we, we complete it, and two years later, we, we, we have to turn it on. So one of the benefits of the third intake project also is drawing water from that low in Lake Mead um, actually has some pretty significant uh, beneficial impacts to water quality. And the first is temperature. Um, the temperature impact uh, ends up being able, allowing us to be able to supply water that has lower uh, disinfection by byproduct values. And so that's, uh, that's a really a fantastic benefit for us. And also what it does is it allows for us to be able to potentially use that water, that thermal ability uh, to be able to minimize some of the, um, the cooling load in the valley uh, that we're working on right now potentially benefiting some conservation measures. So there's all kinds of different benefits as a result of, of the project and uh, um, we're, we're experiencing some of them and we're actually looking toward the future to benefit from even more of that. 